To get your fabric ready for cutting, you first have to straighten the grain. So you will grab one corner and your partner will grab the opposite diagonal corner and you'll both pull tight. Then do the same thing on the other corner. You grab one side and your partner grabs the opposite diagonal side and you pull. Then you're ready to fold your fabric in half. Now the only thing you have to check first is to see if you have direction or nap to your fabric. For most fabrics you can cut it out anyway and it doesn't really matter, but sometimes your fabric has a direction and if you cut it out the wrong way it'll be upside down. So check first and if you do have direction then you have to cut your fabric right down the middle through the long side first and then fold them together so that they are both facing the same direction. My fabric doesn't have direction so I can just take the cut edge and fold it right in half so that the selvages are together on the sides and the cut edges are together on the bottom. So it's a nice long wide fold. Now if you have pre-washed your fabric or if your fabric is wrinkly you may want to press it first. Mine is in good shape so I'm okay. Then you're going to put your pattern put it close to one side and then you'll put on weights Put them at every corner and in between so that your paper pattern is held down well. And then you're going to take a piece of tailoring chalk, whichever piece will show up well on your fabric, and you'll just draw along the outside edge. So right beside the edge of the fabric, and always check underneath before you cut and draw, make sure that the edges are meeting. You don't want to have it fine on the top and then um, too small underneath. So just draw right on that edge all the way around and then you can use your black scissors the same number as your machine or feel free to use the silver scissors use whichever pair feel comfortable. If you're having trouble cutting see me I can give you a few different options for scissors. Then you're going to remove weights And you're going to cut through both layers of fabric. So start at the bottom of the leg, go up the side, do the rise or the crotch, and try not to cut off the tailoring chalk line that you drew. Try to cut right beside it. Now I will have measured this on you to see if you're happy with the length. So if you feel like uh, you want them a little longer than what we designed, or a little shorter, you can feel free to um, adjust that. And also on the bottom, if your fabric is not pre-washed, we may decide to add a little bit extra so that when it shrinks, it's, it's still going to fit you. But basically, you're going to cut every side of every piece, and then we're going to go to the serger.